Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Well, today is Saturday, February 11th. I'm down Garrett County, Maryland. It's cold, it's 24 degrees. Uh, but it's been unseasonably warm, so usually this time of year I'd be on the ice, but the ice isn't real safe, so I don't even think there's much ice on the lake. Uh, but today I'm gonna be fishing the Savage River and possibly some of its tributaries. And I'm gonna be looking for some wild brown and some native brook trout. So let's see how I do. Speed it up. Savage River Reservoir. Let's another look at the Savage River Reservoir. There's the dam. If you can see that. And I am going to fish down below the dam. There's the dam. I'm gonna go fish down below the dam. Tell me that ain't beautiful. All right, I got fish on. So my first one of the day and I got it on a zebra midge I don't know if it's a brook or a brown but let's see all right looks like a little brookie Come on. Oh yeah. 
see that. That's why I came here today, right there. And you can see the corner of his mouth. That's my DT Zebra Midge. It works for these trout here in Savage River, too. First try of the day. Nice brookie. I get a release on him. My hands are freezing. There he goes. I'm gonna set this camera down on a rock somewhere and have a quick chat. fishing this river for, I don't know, a good, good bit of years, and uh, it's not real easy to navigate, um, but it's beautiful, and the, the trout here are born and raised right here, and I come here, I don't have great days here, I'll come here and I'll catch two or three fish, but uh, there's something about this place that just really relaxes me. Um, my dad passed away in 2020. I came right to this spot and I stood right here and it helped me. And this week my grandmother passed away and here I am again standing right here in this same spot. And uh, I can't describe it but uh, it eases my mind and it just helps me. So, my point is, anyone out there who's struggling or feels like there's no answers, you should try this. Um, it helps just being out in nature and, and the, hearing the water moving and chance to catch a, a fish that's born right here. Uh, I can't describe it and I, I wish more people could feel that way. So, just wanted to give you my two cents and let's keep fishing. Little flashy zebra midge, see it? Catch me another one. Oh, there's fish on. That's a good brown. Nice brown. All right. Yeah, baby. Come on. Stand right on this rock. See his head shaking. Number two today. I missed one and I landed one and let's see if I can get this one. Good brown. You aren't gonna rush them. Fishing this stream is all about quality and not quantity. Not like going to Erie and hooking into 30 steelhead. I like this more, to be honest with you. This is uh, this is one of my favorite streams. I just hope I land them. There he is. This 
is a beautiful fish. I just don't want to horse him. Try to get them in over here now. Right over here. Yeah. Nice. Look at that. Look at that. Let's keep them in the water. Beautiful. All right. Here is the brown I just got. Beautiful, beautiful colors, huh? There he goes. So this isn't going to be my best fishing video, but it's going to be one of my more meaningful videos, at least to me, and then hopefully to some of you guys. Um, I've recently heard of and know of people that have taken their own life and uh, it seems like it's happening more frequently um, I don't know if that's true but it just seems like it is if, if you're going through something and, and, and you feel hopeless get out here and do this Okay, just get out in nature, even if you don't fish. Come out here and just walk around and see this beautiful place. It bounces you back, I promise. Like I said, when I lost my dad, I came right to this spot. I lost my grandmother this week, came right back to this spot. That's what helps me. I can help you too. Fly shop, I just stopped in there. I've never stopped in there before. It's the uh, Savage River Outfitters. I met Wendy, really nice lady. All right, that's a wrap on the Savage River. I didn't fish anywhere else. I was considering maybe um, going to uh, some brook streams on the other side of where the uh, Savage flows into the reservoir. But um, I just didn't take the time this time. But that'll be a future video. That'll be the uh, brook trout series. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. One last look at the Savage River.